Another accident. Whatever, push. You be walking in my shoes before. Excellent job. I have something special waiting for you back here. Emma. I know you'll love what I created for you. Really, some of my best work. Now, if you keep this up, I can measure the chaos caused by your actions and perhaps come up with an upgrade for you. See them?
I've been thinking a lot about those days on the campaign trail. I bet we can use a lot of those techniques against the Zin. Sounds like a strange comparison, but okay. I was 12 hours into Dead Island when the Zin attacked. Now I'll never finish. I won't forgive them for that. told me about those large maintenance domes. I'd like to see how things... Destroy one for starters.
sound like a lot of different video game characters, don't you? Sixty-six percent. Making shield at thirty-three percent. Simulation. Mind keeping any security off him while I get it installed?
Moving on to the next. I'd like to see the difference between the security programs in the stores. How about hacking a garage for a stuff? Thank <laughs> you. 
Security breach. Lock down in 30 seconds. That's it. Got all the data I need. Next time I see you, I'll have that upgrade. Thanks for the help with that. At least now I don't feel like I'm flying blind here when it comes to Zin programming. Here's that upgrade for you. Though I know you love the outfit more. Of course I do. I need help inserting a virus into the simulation, among other things. Do this, and I will reward you. Do not do this, and you will get nothing. Understand? Yeah, I got it.
Lucas enjoy upsetting Zinyak. Show him you are better than his people at his favorite game show. fans to another round of telekinetic tomfoolery where it truly is mine over murder right you are zach and here with us again today is the unstoppable force and the leader of the free world the president of the united states and what a perfect contestant for the show bobby so far this is proving to be the perfect combination an undefeated human with the abilities of an alien meeting the challenges of the mad professor and entertaining everyone in the galaxy. What more could our audience want? Other than freedom from alien oppression, the reconstruction of their home planet, and football on the television every Sunday, I can't think of a thing. Now, Bobby, you know we're not supposed to speak ill of our most benevolent overlord, Zinyak. Uh, I'm sure Zinyak had a good reason for blowing up the Earth like he did. A good reason. A, a very good reason, no doubt. Let's check out how our contestant is doing, shall we? So how do you think things are going for our contestant, Zach? Uh, in this match, uh, or in life in general? I was thinking the first, but now that you mention it, let's talk about the second. Well, I imagine it's not easy for them knowing that they're responsible for the deaths of billions of people through their hubris and what will ultimately be an unsuccessful bid to overtake Zinyak. My thoughts exactly. Bringing about the near extinction of the human race is a heavy load to carry. It sure is. I've been dirty, Zach. We're just... ...of a megalomaniacal alien overlord, Bobby. It's not our fault. Let's get back to the action. This is some championship-level mind over murder, Bobby. I agree. The president sure is giving the folks at home one heck of a show. And I know Professor Genki is... Genki fans to another round of telekinetic tomfoolery where it truly is mine over murder. Right you are, Zach. And here with us again today is the unstoppable force and the leader of the free world, the president of the United States. And what a perfect contestant for the show, Bobby. So far, this is proving to be the perfect combination. An undefeated human with the abilities of an alien meeting the challenges of the mad professor and entertaining everyone in the galaxy. What more could our audience want? Other than freedom from alien oppression, the reconstruction of their whole planet, and football on the television every Sunday, I can't think of a thing. Now, Bobby, you know we're not supposed to speak ill of our most benevolent overlord, Zinyak. I'm sure Zinyak had a good reason for blowing up the Earth like he did. A good reason. A, a very good reason, no doubt. Let's check out how our contestant is doing, shall we? So how do you think things are going for our contestant, Zach? Uh, in this match, uh, or in life in general? I was thinking the first, but now that you mention it, let's talk about the second. Well, I imagine it's not easy for them knowing that they're responsible for the deaths of billions of people through their hubris and what will ultimately be an unsuccessful bid to overtake Zinyak. My thoughts exactly. Bringing about the near extinction of the human race is a heavy load to carry. It sure is. I've been dirty, Zach. We're just the pawns of a megalomaniacal alien overlord, Bobby. It's not our fault. Let's get back to the action. This is some championship-level mind over murder, Bobby. I agree. The president sure is giving the folks at home one heck of a show. And I know Professor Genki is loving it. Indeed. Everybody's favorite mad cat enjoys nothing more than murder, mutilation, and mascots. He does love alliteration, Bobby. I thought that was assonance. Assonance is when the words begin with vowels. Really? 
Well, you learn something new every day. I can't help but be impressed by this contestant, Zack. I feel fortunate to see this action firsthand. How about you? I... I just... I... Uh, I, I said, how uh, about you, Zack? I... I can't do this! I can't do this anymore, Bobby! Keep it together, Zack. You hate to upset our most benevolent overlord. I miss my wife, Bobby. Uh, so do I, Zack. So do I. Another win by the leader of the Saints. Did you expect anything else, Bobby? I have determined where inserting my virus would be most effective. Protect the area while I do this. Why is everyone always... some of their code. Completing one of the race programs will accomplish this.
Your reward is waiting. Come claim it.
You accomplished what I asked you to do, so here is your reward. Now, continue with this task if you value doing everything you can in this world. Guess I don't have a choice. I have created a masking program, which needs to be uploaded with your help. With the masking program in place, disrupt it. Chaos will give it time to work.
Destruction always relaxes. Give old people drugs. You are closer to completing all objectives in the simulation. Return to me. I'll just drive till they fall. Take her for a ride. 
I can't believe I have to work a double shift. This was made especially to reward you. Now I need you to continue by stabilizing one of my rifts. Doing so will aid in earning you more bragging rights. And we'll get you a reward. Well, at least you're direct. With the masking program in place, disrupting the system through chaos will give it time to work. event. How do you think it'll go today, Bobby? Given this player's previous performances, I can only expect a great show and a big W in the win column, Zach. I have to agree, Bobby. It seems there's nothing this contestant can't do, including outshining Zinyak's own people with her own powers. Careful what you say there, Zach. Remember what happened to us both after your breakdown at the end of the last show. Oh, well, the Wardens have uh, very big hands, Bobby. Yes, they do. I'm just glad to be able to sit down comfortably with them. <laughs> oh, I hear ya. Well, like my eighth grade gym teacher used to say, the probe is no joke. Oh, you said that one. I hope our contestant is doing better than I am right now. Well, Bobby, seeing the president in action here reminds me of the tales about the king. I was thinking the same thing, Zach. If only we had been around to see those matches firsthand. Now, for those at home who haven't heard the stories, what do they need to know now? This was decades ago. Zinyak had conquered a planet of warriors. Much like our contestant, one of them stood above the rest and challenged Zinyak himself. Zinyak threw everything he had at the man, but the king just did not stop. Eventually, Zinyak managed to rip the king's mind from his body and bury it deep in his own simulation. Ever since, the king has been looking to escape and get his revenge against our most benevolent overlord. Well, let's hope we never see him again, huh, Bobby? Oh, the king has probably driven himself insane by now. Can you imagine being locked away for so many years with just yourself to talk to? I've had that dream, Bobby. It's cold and it's dark. It's lonely. It's so lonely. <laughs> oh, there, there, Zach. Come on now. You're never going to be alone. Lonely. Not while I'm around. Come here. Lonely. So cold, I can't. Smashing performance by the contestant so far. Smashing? I don't think I've heard you use that before. Well, I'm trying something new, Bobby. Uh, what do you think? You know, I've always wanted an occasion to use a jolly good. Oh, hello there, little British, are you? That's a classic right there. Hard to pull off with an American accent, though. 
like trying to use bloody and arse. <laughs> what is up with Americans using arse? Yeah, arse never works, but I know people who use it all the time. I don't get it. Well, some things are just mysteries, Bobby. I've been thinking, Bobby, have you seen the professor around much? Not since the mass abduction and obliteration of the Earth, Zach. I can't help but think he's watching over us from wherever he is, like a guardian angel. A sick, sadistic, cat-headed guardian angel. <laughs> or maybe he's hiding in the shadows with a baseball bat and a hand grenade just waiting for an opportunity to bash someone's head in and make them go boom. Much more likely scenario, Zach. That is what folks tune into this event for. Absolutely. That and your stellar commentary, Zach. Well, thanks, guy. You know, you're no slack yourself, Bobby. I have always been impressed by your wordplay. Well, you forced me to step up my game in order to keep up with you, Zach. <laughs> We're running out of things to say, aren't we? We absolutely are, Zach. Yeah. Yeah. Zinyak for his continued support of the show and for sparing our lives so we may continue to exalt his most highest glory. Good, Good night, night, everybody! everybody. You have done well. Now I will no longer be the cause of you not completing all the tasks available for you to do. Here is your immediate reward as well. Pleasure doing business. Thank you.
Remember that time you had to outrun those protesters in Boise? It's kinda like that. I wonder where Brad is taking me to dinner tonight. <laughs> Remember when Pierce got in a fight with that reporter? That was a mess. Think you can do more damage than those two did? This is terrible. I need a better commute. Needs to get a car.
entrance. Sign your mug. Be this bad. Can we go right to start? This totally freaks fight. me out. What if another one gets blown up? Until this gets... Sometimes I'll tell you, but you gotta do it again. I got no trophies in that game. That's a day for the Saints.
relax and drive.
Shields with powers will help. Oh, <laughs> 